So, I mean, it, overall, I mean, hey, it sucks to lose, but uh, only one person can win in the end, so it's always nice to come, get, um, getting the invite, top six teams, I mean, having a chance to win and then keep going is always a blessing, so um, next year, or if there is next year, hopefully we can take advantage of it and go a little farther. I hope that it's something the conference continues to do because it's a good experience for the kids to come and have, be in this atmosphere and this kind of, you know, live or let die kind of thing, for lack of a better word, that, you know, you win or you go home. And, and it also is good because it gives the kids, you know, in the past, it's if you win the regular season, you're probably in, you know, the region, in the regional tournament, the NCAA tournament. But now, I mean, we came in and we're like, we have a shot to get there. We didn't, you know, our regular season, we didn't end up the way we wanted to, but we have this. And this year it didn't go the way we wanted to, but, you know, I hope it's something that continues in the future. Uh, the girls have really pulled together all year long. Uh, I think it's a testament to their hard work that uh, we were able to get the, the win tonight. You know, we had we had 12 new players this year, and I think the uniqueness of it is that they had to really learn to play together. Uh, we graduated three of our leading scorers last year. Uh, I think, you know, we're, we're not as athletic as we were as last year, but at the same time, I think this team executes better than last year's team. Uh, I think, you know, they, they've really learned how to work well together. Uh, they share the basketball with each other. Uh, I think it's, a, it's an environment where at any night, you know, any girl could step up and, and be our leading scorer. Art Academy is a really good team. I think uh, it's going to be an exciting game. Uh, both teams are very athletic. Uh, they're very talented. Uh, I think that uh, it's going to be a good game tomorrow night. Tonight we came out and we knew that everybody's tense. Everybody's trying to change the game up. They're trying to go a little harder. But we just came out knowing that we need to just play our game. And I think um, we we're a little more relaxed than the other team. We knew we had to come in and run today. Actually, like run and run and run. And that's been our upper hand on over most teams. We like to just push and outrun other teams. I think we just uh, needed to play our game, and that's what we did. I think at Dixie, uh, we we still did that, but 
this hit tonight, we were able to play our game better. Comment on that? Uh, <laughs> it, I think in large part, uh, obviously it's very humbling. Uh, I'm very excited about it. I think it's uh, it's it's good for our school and our program. Uh, but at the same time, I think you know it doesn't happen unless these young ladies you know buy into what we're trying to do. You know, and I think uh, you know as we talk about this run that we've made, you know, I think in large part it's because. They really just pull together, you know, and, and become one, you know, and I think that's a beautiful thing that's happening, you know, and we just look forward to just kind of keep moving forward.